Hey guys, I'm Gabrielle and welcome back to the scary text message story. Today we're going to be playing text from my creepy stalker. No need to watch your back because your stalker already is. <laughs> that sounds so good. Let's jump right into it. Holly, my stalker is outside of our house. Holly Ann, we have been over this. You don't have a stalker. Mom, I am telling you, someone has been stalking me for weeks. You have a very overactive imagination, sweetie. There's a car on the street with tinted windows. It's been outside of our house for hours. I'm sure it belongs to the new neighbors. They seem nice. You never believe me. I swear someone has been watching me. I feel like everywhere I go, there's eyes on my back. And when I turn around, someone's always walking in the opposite direction. That's how sidewalks work, sweetie. People going in opposite directions of you. <laughs> Now please finish your homework before I get home. Susie Weston's going to be over tonight to go over your trig work with you. Fine. Don't believe me. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> I was just gonna say, does she really have a stalker? But mm, I think the unknown number is the stalker. Holly Reed, who is this? That doesn't matter yet. I've been watching you. OMG, you have? I knew I wasn't crazy. I mean, ew, what the heck? Who are you, creep? I'm more interested in you at the moment. Is this some sort of prank? Because it's not funny. No, it's not funny, Holly, age 16, lives at 308 North Willow Street. Attends Knights High School and has an after work job at the Doggy Groomers on Main Street and Fifth. Okay, incredibly creepy, but still all very basic information someone from my school would know. Mother is Hannah, father is Richard of Richard and Associates, number one law firm in the state. Or shall I say, was. Business isn't going too well. Your father's been stressed about money. Your mom had to ask your grandmother for a loan and is thinking about going back to work. <laughs> As a second grade teacher, something she did before you were born. Okay, okay, you've officially freaked me out! Why the heck are you stalking me? My life is so boring! That's what she's concerned about right now is how boring her life is? Not that she has a stalker? Your life is anything but boring, Holly Reed. And why I'm stalking you is a very easy question to answer. I had to make sure you were the right one. The right one for what? The right one for me to kidnap? What? What? I'm joking, man. If you could see the look on your face. You can see my face right now? Yes, you're sitting on your bed. Why is this stalker? What do they want from me? And no, closing the curtains won't change anything. Are you spying on me? How did you get into my house? Spare key under the cat statue on the back porch. Only I expected a bit more creativity, but... <laughs> so what are you going to do with me then if you're not going to kidnap me? Are you going to, you know... <gasps> Your mother was right. You do have an overly active imagination. You heard that conversation? I've heard every word uttered over the past two months, Holly. But what I want is for you to do me a favor. You're going to rob a bank for me. What? Are they serious this time? Or is this a joke like the kidnap thing? What? Why in the world would I do a creepy stalker a favor? Especially when that favor is rob a bank. Technically, it's a safety security box and it's mine. So it's not really a stealing. Why don't you just get it yourself then? Because I can't. Why? Because I can't. What's in the security safety deposit box? And I can because? You ask a whole lot of questions, don't you? I think I have the right to these questions. I know, seriously, this unknown stranger wants me to go and then rob a box or whatever, and they're not gonna tell me, one, what's inside of it, or two, why I can go and get it and they can't if it's their box? Fine, a friend made a security box for me, but I can't get there at the moment. I really need to get something they left for me, so I need you to do it for me. I need what's inside of that box more than anything. I am still so confused. Holly, do this for me and I promise your family's money problems go away. You won't have to move to Ohio with your grandma. <gasps> what? How do they know all this stuff? My dad hates grandma. Were they seriously considering that? Oh my god, Holly didn't even know. Things are worse than you know, Holly. 
Fine, I'll do it. No, don't do it, Holly, that's a horrible idea. I'm so nervous, I'm gonna throw up. Pull yourself together. Go to the security guard and tell him you're Kelly Rogerson and want to make a withdrawal from safe 508. What's inside the box? A red box. And inside that one, you're about to find out now, aren't you? <laughs> I don't wanna do this anymore. Holly, you have to. I don't have to do anything. You're some psycho stalker who is forcing me to do this. I don't even know what I'm doing, but I'm pretty sure it's sus and could get me thrown in jail. So, I'm out. <laughs> Good for you, Holly. Honestly, I was a little surprised that she said she's gonna go along with this. I mean, I know her family needs the money, but like, is it worth it? I don't think so. Holly, please. I know this doesn't make any sense to you, but you're my only chance at getting what I want. And what is it you want? Money, a yacht, private island? The truth. Not quite what I was expecting. <laughs> I know you have no reason to trust me, but you're my only hope at getting the truth. The truth of her what? Now I'm spooked out. What is happening? I promise I'll explain everything. Just get me what's inside that box. Is she gonna do it or is she gonna leave? I don't know what she should do. I am stressed. Like if this person is literally stalking her, why on earth does she believe her in like any way? I told the guard my name is Kelly Rogerson. OMG, he said he's checking the picture in my profile to verify me. Should I run? Relax, you'll be fine. I have no idea who Kelly Rogerson is, but I'm pretty sure I don't look like her. This is a trap, am I gonna get thrown in jail? Just trust me. OMG. The guard just gave me a key and is leading me down the bag. See, told you not to worry. There are so many boxes down here. What the heck, what is inside of this box? Like I literally have no idea. Well, the guard left to give me some privacy and I opened the box. <laughs> I am so nervous. A red box, just like you said. I told you I wasn't lying. Okay, I'm opening the box now. What, is it empty? I can't believe I was so stupid. I can't believe I let a stranger talk me into this. What was inside the box? Holly, what is in the box? I don't know what the heck you're playing at or if you're working with someone else or what, but I'm not going to walk out of here with solid bricks of gold. <gasps> Wait, what? I don't know who this Kelly is or what you're trying to steal from her, but I'm not doing it. I'll find another way to help my family. Holly, no! Is there something else in there? What more were you expecting? Diamonds? Papers, Holly! I am looking for a folder, or papers, or a USB stick. I'm leaving. Holly, wait! Okay, uh! Okay, you want the truth? Yes! I'm Kelly Rogerson. <laughs> what? You're lying. Why would I lie about that? Because you're a lying stalker, that's why! Just look under the gold, please. Tell me if there's anything more. There's a sealed envelope under all the gold and this key. Oh my gosh, wait, it's a post office. Wait, what? I'm so confused. Oh, what is going on? Oh my gosh. What? Take the key and envelope and leave. Now. What about the gold? You're the one who just said you weren't taking the gold. Sheesh, okay, grabbing and going. Two hours later, Holly, please answer my text. I told you to stop messaging me. Why? Why? Because you're a stalker, that's why. Because you are a stalker and a thief and possibly murderer. Murderer? Gosh, you really got the creative genes, didn't you? Enough about my overactive imagination. I wasn't imagining having a stalker and I'm not imagining this. Who is Kelly Rogerson? Did you kill her? Was the box from your accomplice telling you where to find the rest of the money or the body? If I killed her, wouldn't I know where the body was, Sherlock? This isn't funny. Okay, okay, you're right, sorry. I'm telling you the truth. I am Kelly Rogerson. They wouldn't have let you into the security box if I wasn't. But why did they? They literally said they were going to look at a picture of Kelly in her profile. If you set up the security box, took a picture for the profile, why would they then let me in? Because you, Holly Reed, look just like me. <laughs> what? What is happening? How could I possibly look just like you? Because we're identical twins. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this was so good! You guys, 
up. Make sure to subscribe so you can know as soon as I post part two because oh my god, this is so good. If you enjoyed it as much as I did, let me know down below in the comments and let me know what you think is going to happen next. Do we believe? Like, why would she lie about that though? Oh, I have so many questions. Okay, make sure to follow me on Instagram so you can hang out in between uploads. Gabriella Scory. Until next time, check out the awesome videos I have for you on screen and I'll see you guys later for another scary text message story. Bye!